Hi, these are TNA Impact spoilers for the 6th of June 2010. Sting is out, he says not everything as it seems coming from him. Might seem ironic, but there's a lot of snake and mirrors going on. He's been in the place before where he needs to defend his reputation. He feels he doesn't have to. He'll reveal the meaning of his actions soon enough. He doesn't know RVD that well, and RVD doesn't know him that well. RVD was just in the wrong place at the wrong time. When he takes the title from RVD, the curtain will be pulled back and everyone exposed. The arena goes dark and the footage of Sting's reaction, recent action plays on the screen. Eric Bischoff comes out using the crutch with Miss Tess Nature. He has a spotlight on Sting. He knows Sting a long time and thinks Sting. Sting's trying to prove to people that he's a superhero. For so long, he's lost sight of the truth. It's not about him, it's about the company. Not just one person, it's about the action, and tonight he'll be in action. Simone Joe sneaks behind Sting, and Bischoff announces him as Sting's opponent. Joe attacks Sting, but Matt Morgan runs down and attacks Joe. Sting and Matt Morgan beat on Joe until RVD runs down for the save. Eric Bischoff says he this isn't over and they will continue later in a tag team match. Samoan Joe and RVD versus Sting and Matt Morgan. RVD gets on the mic and says, hang on, every guy... Every guy is out here and is in for himself. He asks that the match can be changed to a four-way. Bischoff says that he doesn't have the authority. Then Hulk Hogan's music hits and comes and out comes Hogan. He says RVD is the champion and that gives him some pull around here. So that you've got a brother and this match is a fail four-way. Rosie Latter Love, fucking really, the new acu, acu, look, accusation, Mary Kate Dung, Dungier, recently signed by TNA, versus Roxy, during the match, Madison Rain runs down and gives a Roxy a bout shot, um, while the ref isn't lucky, looking, Rosie doesn't like it and argues with Madison. During this, Roxy schoolgirls Rosie for the win. Afterwards, JB interviews Rosie and asks what's going on. She says if Madison thinks she can take out the ugly people one at a time, she's got another thing coming. Because she's big, she's bad, she's beautiful, and she's got a whole lot of love everybody <coughs> for everybody. She lays a kiss on JB and leaves. Um, AJ starts with Ric Flair versus Kaz versus Jay Lethal. Winner via quick roll up, Jay Lethal. The whole match, AJ and Kaz were arguing who does cooler moves or what to do next to, next on Lethal. Lethal got the win while they were arguing. Afterwards, Flair got in the ring and yelled at AJ. He gave AJ the honor of being his protege and he gets beat up by Jay Lethal. He tells him to go home and think about who he wants to be because right now he's not in Ric Flair's good grace. He continues belting AJ and telling him to go home and make a lifetime decision. On his way back Angle comes out and gets in AJ's face. AJ yells something at him and leaves. Angle heads to the ring. He gets on the mic and says he came out to show Kaz the proper respect before he makes him a victim. He likes to let his opponents know what he's going to do and he and he plans to retain his belt and Kaz is number 10 so as sl sl slammiversary he is 
he it will be his opponent. Flair asks if he realizes he just passed him by. And he says he wants his son Reed to be like Angle, the greatest amateur wrestler. He wants his son um, Flair come, came to Angle for the help out of respect, but Angle did. Um, but now they're in Flair's world, and whatever Angle did, an amateur, he's done it ten times over. In wrestling, he's a god. He gives o Hogan respect. He gives Sting respect. And until Angle realizes that he's gave him no respect. He tells Angle to leave. He says, show him respect and leave before he takes his sport coat off. He says, hang on, show me respect and let me show how good, how a god acts. Angle holds Angle holds the rope and opens for Flair and then attacks Flair on the way out. Kaz tries to attack Angle but tosses him out of the ring. Matt Morgan versus Stink versus Samoan J versus RVD. Hernandez is showed up in the stands and distracted Morgan. Samoan Joe grabbed Morgan and gave him the muscle buster. RVD then hit Joe with a top rope sidekick and gave Morgan a five star frog splash for the win. Afterwards, Samoan Joe and RVD had words and left. That's it for DNA spoilers. Be sure to check out WCRonline.com and subscribe. Cheers.